In 2003, I went to see an eye doctor for the first time in my life. He told me that I had some astigmatism. This meant that I could see straight lines as not so straight. In a practical sense for shooting, a front sight that looked like this could look like this. To solve this problem, I got a pair of specialized shooting glasses and used them at all stages of fire. This seemed to work well for all the years that I shot metallic sights. When scopes came along, I just kept using my glasses just like I did before. I wasn't really sure if I still needed to use them, but if they worked for me with irons, I didn't want to change too much when moving to optics. It turned out that there was actually quite a bit of difference when looking through a scope without my shooting glasses, but I only discovered this by accident. Let me show you how that happened. One of the earliest scopes I looked through was the Night Force Competition SR. Its reticle looks something like this. If we zoom towards the center, we can see a small cross inside of a circle. It would be logical to assume that this is the way the reticle appears at all times. Ah, but that would be a mistaken assumption. When looking through the night force, even with my naked eye, the reticle looks like it should. But take a look at what I see when I bring the reticle in line with the target. The image changes to look like this. When I move the sight picture away from the target, the reticle returns to its normal configuration. Pretty drastic difference, right? That would look especially confusing if I was trying to line up the shot and my sight picture focuses on what should be the cross. But this wasn't the only time a scope reticle looked odd with no optical correction. While on Commercial Road, Camp Perry, I looked through a scope that had fairly simple crosshairs across the entire image. I put the scope up to my eye and saw an image that looked like this. Notice how the vertical crosshairs are blurry while the horizontal ones are sharp. At first I thought there was something wrong with the reticle focus. But then I realized when I rotated the scope, what was blurry became clear. Conversely, the clear crosshairs became blurry as they rotated from horizontal to vertical. Watch what happens when I rotate the scope back to its original orientation. Pretty weird, right? These experiences have just reinforced the fact that I should be wearing my astigmatism correction whenever I look through the sights. If you haven't had an eye exam in a while and things look a little odd in your new scope, it might be time to make an appointment.